what is going on guys let's try out this rotke pds pressure center on our pcv vacuum hose so that just connects to the intake manifold and i have a sink on cylinder one ignition and the lines are going into the passenger side window and this is going to let us measure the pulses the pulls from the intake valves while the engine's running. So let's go ahead and start it up. All right, so here we go. We're, our scope is running. The yellow line is pressure and the blue line is sink. Ignition. So, these are our intake poles, and these are our ignition sink for number one. Let's go ahead and try to... Just wanna capture one that's... One more time. Okay, so this is cylinder one, ignition, and then this is going to be the fire order is going to be one, three, four, and two, and then back to one. So we want to find the intake pull for cylinder one. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to find the companion cylinder for one, which is number four. So this is going to be cylinder one, three, four. So when four fires, it's going to be on its power stroke, its companion cylinder number one is gonna be on its intake stroke. So this is the intake pull for the number one cylinder. And you can see that the pattern is fairly regular across this sweep. And the peaks are not as, it's not as clean as I had hoped. I was kind of hoping to just get like individual peaks, but the pattern is still consistent. The car is running perfectly. So this is a quick way to check that you don't have anything really wrong with the intake valves. Um, we can also, uh, determine the RPM from knowing this space between this, right, from this event to this event for cylinder one ignition. We can calculate this time, and then we can go ahead and calculate the RPM from that. I'll put that in the description. So I just wanted to show that to you guys. I thought that was kind of cool. Again, it's not as perfect as I wanted it to be, but I think it, it makes the point, and you can definitely determine which of these is the cylinder one intake pull. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. Have a great day.